Hi everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel Learn Commerce with Namita. In today's video, we are going to prepare loan amortization schedule. So, we are preparing loan amortization schedule in the Excel. For that, we require some following information that is, rate of interest, loan amount, number of years, then in months effective rate and EMI. So you can calculate the loan amortization for car loan, house loan or any purpose if you are taking a loan. So you can prepare the loan amortization schedule in Excel. So first we'll take rate of interest. We'll take rate of interest say suppose 8% loan amount 7,50,000 Number of years, consider the number of years for this loan is 7 years. Now, in 7 years, how many months will be there? We need to calculate. Select is equals to 7, multiply it by 12, press enter. So, total 84 months are there in 7 years. We have to pay EMI for 80 four months now effective rate effective rate is basically what emi is what stands for what equated monthly installment so per month we are paying some interest in the form of loan so is equals to rate of interest is eight percent divided by 12 press enter so 0.0, .0 667 is the effective rate. Now we will calculate EMI. So to calculate EMI, formula is is equals to PMT bracket open rate. Now we have calcul uh, select effective rate comma number of months that is 84 select comma PV means the loan amount, select, comma, FV that is what present value, so type 0, comma, now type that is what end of the period, it means what payment is timed at the end of the period, so put 0 and bracket close, press enter, now here the EMI is in negative okay so to make it positive just put minus sign before selecting the loan amount so you will get the answer in positive okay so now we got the emi now let's prepare the loan amortization schedule for 84 months so prepare a table in this way month loan amount months, loan amount, EMI, interest paid, principal paid and balance. Now in the month take total 84 months. Why? Because the loan is taken for 7 years. In 7 years 84 months are there. So in months type all 84 months. Okay. Now after months Next is what? Loan amount. How much is the loan amount? 7,50,000. So type here is equals to select, press enter, 7,50,000. Now EMI, how much is the EMI? 11,689.66. So press is equals to select, press enter. Next, we have to find interest paid is equals to sign, select the loan amount, multiply it by effective rate, press enter. So, interest we paid for first month is 5000 out of this EMI. Okay, how we have got you and uh, 
I hope you have understood. For interest paid, press is equals to sign. Then select loan amount. Multiply it by effective rate. Next, we have to find the principal paid. Principal paid is equals to select EMI minus interest paid. Press enter. So, interest paid we will get. Okay. So, if we add this interest paid and principal paid, the total you will get 11,689. Okay, that means out of this EMI for the first month, 5,000 we are paying as an interest to the bank and out of this 7,50,000 7, uh, 7, we are paying for the first month 6,689. Okay. Now balance, to find balance say is equals to select loan amount minus principal, press enter. Okay, this is the balance. Okay, now first month we got the loan amortization schedule. For the second month, for second month, the loan amount will be the balance, press is equals to Select the balance, sell, enter. Okay. Now next EMI. For EMI, every month we have to keep this EMI same as it is. So press is equals to select. Now lock this EMI by Typing dollar and press enter. So now this EMI is locked for 84 months. Next we have to find interest paid is equals to select loan amount, multiply it by effective rate. Now lock effective rate also by putting the dollar sign, press enter. So effective rate is locked for 84 months. Next, interest paid is equals to EMI minus interest paid. So we get interest paid. Uh, principal principal paid now next find the balance is equals to select loan amount minus principal paid enter okay so now in this way we have prepared the loan amortization for second month now simply select all the cells and drag it till 84 months so you can see for total 84 months the loan amortization schedule has been prepared so you can see the loan amount is decreasing by year no, months by months okay and you can see the balance also at the end you will see for 84 months the balance is zero now you can calculate how much interest how much principal we have paid in total is equals to sum bracket Select the first cell of principal paid. For second, select the last cell. Bracket close and press is equals to uh, press enter. So you can see 
total for 84 months you have paid the principal amount that is the loan amount 7 lakh 50000 now from this you have paid the interest also so to calculate interest in total to see that how much interest we have paid to the bank is equals to sign sum open the bracket select the first cell and the last cell bracket close enter so you can see that total 231931 rupees we have paid interest to the bank okay on the loan amount of 750000 okay so in this way you have to prepare the loan amortization schedule through this you can understand that how much we are paying the interest and how much we are paying the principal to the bank so i hope students have understood today's session thank you very much please subscribe my youtube channel like and share the video and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the latest notification